At first glance, it looks harmless, a small, elegant shell lying quietly on the ocean floor, its patterned surface shimmering under the sunlight. But behind that beauty lies one of nature's most dangerous assassins, the cone snail, a creature that proves appearances can be deadly deceptive. Living in the warm, tropical waters of the Indian and Pacific Oceans, the cone snail might seem like just another slow-moving sea dweller. Yet, hidden within its spiral shell is a complex venom system powerful enough to kill a human within minutes. This venom isn't just potent, it's a masterpiece of biological engineering, a chemical cocktail designed for precision and efficiency. So, how does a snail, one of the slowest creatures on Earth, manage to catch its prey? The answer is both fascinating and terrifying. Instead of chasing its meal, the cone snail uses a hollow, venom-filled harpoon, a specialized tooth it launches like a dart. When an unsuspecting fish swims by, the snail fires its harpoon with lightning speed, injecting a dose of neurotoxin so fast that the fish is paralyzed instantly, unable to move or escape. Within seconds, the victim is reeled into the snail's mouth, swallowed whole, alive but motionless. The venom of a cone snail is known as conotoxin, and it's one of the most complex natural poisons ever discovered. It targets the nervous system, blocking signals between the brain and muscles, causing paralysis, respiratory failure, and eventually death. What makes it even more terrifying is that there's no known anti- If a human is stung, survival depends solely on the amount of venom delivered and the speed of emergency treatment. Even with medical help, the odds are slim, about 30 confirmed deaths have been recorded from cone snail stings. Out of more than 700 species of cone snails, only a few, like the textile cone, geographic cone, and tulip cone, possess venom potent enough to kill humans. But the problem is, they all look beautiful, and many divers or shell collectors have made the fatal mistake of picking them up, unaware that these tiny shells can deliver a deadly sting. Scientists have long been fascinated by the cone snail's venom. Interestingly, its chemical complexity is so unique that researchers are studying it for use in painkillers and medical treatments. Some compounds derived from cone snail toxins have shown promise in creating non-addictive alternatives to morphine, proof that even nature's deadliest weapons can hold the power to heal. Still, one rule remains unshaken, never touch a cone snail. Whether it's alive on the seabed or an empty shell washed ashore, it's better to admire from a distance, because beneath that beautiful shell